Hey guys and welcome back to another very interesting video of our channel Versatile Knowledge. This is the first video that we are shooting in 2019 and we wish you all a very happy new year. This video is going to be really interesting as we will be talking with you about Google. Google, the world's largest search engine which gives you answers to almost everything that you type on it or search via voice. From questions like, hey Google, tell me something about yourself, to who is the President of the United States? From the question like, what's the weather in Bangalore? To, hey Google, how can I get rich fast? It answers all the questions that you need, just in a fraction of a second. Have you ever wondered or thought about this question that, how Google can answer all the topics that you type on it or search by voice? In this video, we'll be talking with you about how Google search works in the easiest way possible. Let's get started. When you type something on Google and hit enter, the Google uses something called a spider or a web crawler. This spider or web crawler just visits all the websites, all the articles, videos, the information about the topic that you have typed on Google. Let's consider Google as a huge library. Google contains information about everything that you need or everything that you type on Google. Now let's take an example. You will type on Google, who is Narendra Modi and hit enter. Now Google will have a library. Since we told Google is a library, it will have a librarian to manage all the information that is present on Google. Let's consider that librarian as a spider or a web crawler. Now that librarian or the web crawler visits all the sections that is present in the library. All those sections are basically the websites, the articles, the posts, the videos, the audio files and many other information that is present all over Google about Narendra Modi. This spider or web crawler does not stop there. It also just checks the links that is present inside that website. If there is a link about Narendra Modi in first website, it will go to that link. In that link, there is a video file that is present about Narendra Modi, which gives more information about Modi. It visits that link. In that video, there is a link to some other website. In that website, there is a link to some other audio file. In that audio file, there is a link to some other website and so on and so forth. So basically, it searches billions and billions of copies about Narendra Modi and then it lists all the results on the results page. The results on the results page will be displayed as per the relevance. Now, relevance is a very important term when we talk about any Google search. The relevance on the Google works on something called page rank algorithm. Page rank algorithm is an algorithm that was developed by the Google founders Larry Page and Sergey Brin themselves. Let's now talk how the page rank algorithm lists all the websites that you need about Narendra Modi in the relevance order. The page rank algorithm takes into account how credible the information on that website is present. How many people from the different links are referring to that website? How many people trust that website? How many third party links are pointing to this website? How many people have visited that website? How many people in your location are searching about Narendra Modi? How many people have searched about Narendra Modi today? How many people are searching about Narendra Modi right now? And many other different factors are considered before giving the relevant website on your search results page. After taking all these things into account and doing some computation and many other mathematical calculations, the Google lists down all the information that you need on the search results page. Google doesn't stop right here. Google also uses this results about Narendra Modi that you have searched right now in order to make sure your subsequent searches about Narendra Modi is more accurate and more correct to what you want about Narendra Modi. Let's consider you have searched about Narendra Modi and hit enter. And once you again search Google, it will automatically start suggesting Narendra Modi height, Narendra Modi nationality, Narendra Modi net worth, Narendra Modi biography, Narendra Modi movie. It will basically understand the user and give you more relevant and more accurate results. So after all this explanation, we got to know that once you type something on Google, Google uses something called 
a spider or a web crawler to just visit all the websites and articles and information that is present about the topic that you have searched. These spiders or web crawlers searches the information that is present in this library called Google and gives you the most relevant information possible. So if you guys have liked this video, hit the like button, share this video with your friends. And if you haven't still subscribed to our channel, hit the subscribe button because we have an awesome year of exciting content coming ahead of you. Thank you for watching guys.